Alright guys, welcome back to JForce Gaming and the reason why you click on this video is probably because you have one of the issues with your iPhone is either you know touch screen not working, start in recovery mode, alright, or like a disabled screen, won't turn on, stuck on Apple logo, you know, battery drain, all this and that, you know, and um you know you are looking for a solution out there. So while you click on my video, you are in luck because today I have the exact solution to your problems, all right? And it is this software right here, all right, the AnyFix. So this thing, all right, can fix any of the issues that you're currently facing on your iPhone, all right, it'll start on boot loop, all this, which I said before, all right, and this works on the latest iOS also as well. So if you have the latest iOS, do not have to worry, all right, and this works on uh, most um, iPhones, all right, ranging all the way up down to, you know, a few years, like iPhone uh, 5, iPhone 6, all this, all right. It will work effortlessly even if you have an iPad, iPod Touch, Apple TV, all right, it will fix all the issues no matter what devices you are on. So this is a very uh, comprehensive all-in-one software to fix any of your problems, all right. So yeah, so um, so if you have any of this software, right, this software can guarantee to help you fix it because I personally have these issues when I was using iPhone last time, all right, and uh, you know I face all these kind of issues more time most common was the stuck at the boot loop one I have no idea why but probably like you know one on the normal day I try to turn it on and it just stuck at the open, open logo Apple logo sorry and uh, you know sometimes if you want to bring it to Apple's to fix they will charge you an absurd price to fix it which is not really worth it because today this video all right for way way less of a price you can get this issue fixed without bringing it to you know the apple service center and you know getting your wallet drained out all right so anyways all right so this software right here today we're going to demonstrate to you talk about the features of this software all right and why i love it and why it helped me all right in so many occasions and, and as well as because i trust software because this software is very safe to use or right, I didn't face any issues after that everything works really well after the repair all right and this software is it is just so easy to use and I just love it I've used this software for a long time all right and right now I'm going to show you the software itself all right, and a bit of demonstration on how you guys can you know recover and you know the, the software demonstration itself of it demonstrating it to um, recover your iPhone all right so without further ado let me just show, show you the software itself and after that we will show you the demonstration all right let's go all right so as you guys can see this is the software right here all right and um yeah so like i say once you get this software all right you are you have access to any other um ver like um, features as well all right so um yeah not only that you can use this software to repair your phone all right but other features as well it can help you upgrade and downgrade ios if you have problem you know upgrading or down down downgrading um, from the current OS using um, from your phone itself, you can use this software to manually upgrade and downgrade as well. So if you don't like the current version of iOS, you can downgrade it as well. All right, you can use it to reset device. There's toolbox. There's iTunes repair. All right, for any uh, restore errors, component crashing errors. All right, and they have toolbox which you know you can use for various stuff. Really, really cool. All right, but today the main thing will be the system repair right over here, all the way to the left. All right, so if you click on repair now. All right, you can repair so many kinds of issues. Either you have screen stuck, device bug, update issues, device cannot connect, iOS port stuck, app issues, or Apple TV issues. All right, so um, yeah, either you click on this one, they will show like different, they can solve what kind of problems. So if you have a specific problem, you just click on various, find which one that suits the current problem you are facing the most. All right, just select one and you can just click on start now all right and they have three different type of repair all right you just have to read it carefully if you were to use like um, advanced repair or ultimate repair do keep in mind that this will erase all the data on your device so make sure that you know you choose correctly before you um, do the repair itself okay so um yeah you might have to see because different repair support different kinds of issues all right so if your issue is a, a bit too you know hard to repair using standard repair you probably need advanced or ultimate just keep in mind that you probably you need to you know have your back data backed up somewhere in iCloud or iTunes, all right. And uh, yeah, and um, ultimate repair is the most comprehensive one, and you know uh, it works generally um, hundred percent. But if you don't want to really erase your data, you can try on standard repair. Just keep in mind that you know these are the you know uh, the more important one, all right, about your data. So once you have chosen the kind of repair that you want, all right, you can just click on advanced repair. All right, and if you're using iPhone, all right, you can select, you can just follow the on-screen instruction it has over here. So if you're using iPhone 14, 15, all right, 
any anything that's iPhone 8 and above, just follow this on screen instructions. Alright, so they have any uh, other for you know for older iPhones. Alright, you can also choose between iPad, iPod and Apple TV. Alright, so once you are done with it and you are you know you are you is in recovery mode, the software will automatically detect and automatically start, you know, the repair process. So right now I'm just show you a clip of it. Um um the go through through the repair process. Alright, and after that you know, resetting the iPhone itself and uh, yeah, just right now let me just show you guys the demonstration itself So as you can see, uh, I have this iPhone 13 that is constantly stuck on boot loop So, um, you know, it'll show up the Apple logo and then after it will show up again So it's just stuck on the Apple logo, logo, right? No matter you turn it on or turn it off, it's just stuck on the Apple logo Alright, so right now I'm just going to use this software to repair it so um yeah I'm gonna just click on um you know, choose the current one that my device current facing which is called screen stuck all right and it's called uh, stuck on Apple logo so just click okay so these are the current problems so I just need to connect it all right and um probably I'm gonna choose go with our advanced repair unless if it doesn't work I'm gonna go with ultimate but I'm gonna just go with advanced itself itself all right so um because it's iPhone 30 so I just follow this on screen instruction and told the power button and the power up button all right so you'll boot boot into recovery recovery mode itself all right so you auto detect all right and you auto detect the phone model all right the system version and you know and the product itself and you will start to download the firmware that is correct for the phone model and uh, software itself all right and the correct iOS version so once it's done I right, just give it a, a while for it to download the firmware itself is about 7.24 gig depending on your phone model and the iOS version you are on but it will probably take about less than two to three minutes depending on the network speed all right but generally it's really fast all right so I'm just let it download for a while all right and once it's done you'll say it's ready just click on start system repair so I just need to click on it and uh, you just say preparing. So I just need to wait for you know for it to prepare. All right, and this do not unplug your device. All right, and importantly, please do not um, open iTunes. All right, so because iTunes might conflict or will conflict with this software. So in any case, do not open iTunes. Make sure your iTunes is closed before starting this software. All right, so um, yeah, let the software do its job. You just have to stay, you know, and just let software do its job and you'll say restarting. And once it say repair completed, all right, so your phone will restart, all right? Alright, so um, let's wait for my phone and oh right, it works. So uh, now it has been restarted. As you can see, finally not showing the Apple logo only anymore. So I just need to, you know, just no more do the setup and you know everything, you know everything. All this, just enter my password. All this. All right, and um, as you guys can see, all right, there is also no Apple ID lock. All right, although it's factory reset, but there is no Apple ID lock. So basically, this software also helps you to remove any Apple ID that is in there. So you just have to add in your own Apple ID. So which is very very use useful. Sometimes if you forget your own Apple ID, this also can help you remove Apple ID. As you guys can see my Apple ID is gone. So you know, just continue all the setup process. You know, and um, after that, I have a. Uh, phone to actually can use it so actually this phone all right gonna start on boot loop i have not been using it for a long time or i just kept it aside because i have no use for that but right now i i have a phone that i can um use as my probably a spare phone and uh, yeah so uh, as you can see everything works and it's not stuck on the boot apple logo anymore Okay, so if you have watched the demonstration, it is so easy. It just requires you a few clicks and you can just start using the phone already. So you don't have to go through a lot of technical things. You don't need coding skills. You don't need programming skills or you know, any really to be really tech savvy to be able to, you know, repair your phone. All right, just with this software, just a few clicks and it can, you know, repair your phone and save you a tons of money rather than you bringing it to, you know, some um, rip repair shop or like um you know apple itself which probably will cost like i say a lot of money they'll charge you overcharge you all right um so uh, with this software just a fraction of a price you can get your phone repaired right in just a few minutes all right and like i said before this software all right once you purchase the license for this software all right you get access to other features as well all right that may be useful or probably sometime you need it in the future you have it 
at the snap of your fingertips right here. Alright, so uh, Mia, you are not only getting access to you know the repair itself, but you get other features, which is really, really awesome. Alright, compared to any other software out there, probably you want to have this feature or this feature, you have to pay extra for you know certain features to unlock certain features, which I really hate it, alright? But with this, it's give you one full software, one full package right, for your iPhone. And you know, without anything set, everything is there. That for you, so if sometimes if you repair, you might you don't want to reset your device or you don't want to re I repair iTunes, you can just do it right on the spot itself, right? So yeah, if you guys want to check out this software, right, check out the first link in the video description down below, all right, I'll link it to this software. I'll definitely try it out for yourself, and there's a free download. You can just download it and try it out for yourself, and if you like it definitely get a license to fully repair your phone. All right, so like I said, this thing works on all kinds of problems or errors that you have with your iPhone, iPad, iPod, or Apple TV. This software will solve all the problems instantly. So you don't have to worry about uh, any of the problems at all. All right, and um, yeah, it is this, the software, the license only costs a fraction of a price where you have to, you know, compared to bringing it to uh, anywhere else. And you know, the, it's very comprehensive. They give you all the other features as well. All right, and it works very easily, very well. I don't have any issues with it after using it for a long time. All right, and uh, generally, I would say that this software is really good, really safe to use, and really stable and super reliable. So once again, if you guys want to check out this software, all right, I will link them the first link in the video description down below for you guys to check it out. So yeah, that's all for today, guys. If you find this video really interesting and helpful and did help you repair and save a lot of money, all right, do give it a thumbs up all right, and comment down below. All right, so that's all for today, guys. And uh, without further ado, this is JForce Gaming, and I shall see you guys in my next video. Peace out. I cry